Hello. In this video we will see how to do rolling updates or blue green deployment using Argo CD. We would require to do some change in deployment YML and see how Argo CD can do this. For that you need to go to GitHub repository from where you have taken the repository URL. So I came to this path and I have the deployment file at here and what I am going to do is basically I'm going to change the image of this deployment file. So currently the image file is basically pavan it zone slash hyt http 28 and I'm going to comment this image and I will add one more line of the image dash image colon and uh, I am going to uh, add some new other image. Uh, so I will use nginx or you can use some other or is there any updates happen into the power IT zone why HYT HTTP So you can also use that too for testing purpose. I'm using nginx image at here and Once the change is done do the commit changes So everything is done at the git repository side now come to Argo CD UI and from there you can see that we have option of deleting but uh, we do not have to do that because this will not be the rolling updates rolling updates is basically your application should be running and accessible by the third party user and during that time you can also do these uh, updates in your application or websites so for that uh, i will just click on sync and from here i will leave everything as it is and i'll do synchronize so you can see that the rolling update is started. You can see here the pod is still running, but the new pod is still creating at here. So the new pod has been created and the old pod is being marked as hold. As a history, you can also say that. So once you will click on this, you will see the complete status of it and just go to the website and do refresh. You can see that your website content has been changed from your website to the nginx websites so how this you can do that okay so now it's time to uh, check the application details so you can just click on diff and you can compare that what have you changed and into the events you can see that what happened and how it has been performed according to the uh, templates onto the Kubernetes cluster so everything will be mentioned at here and you can also view the summaries. So these are the tab that you can use. Now you can see that the everything is working perfectly very easily. Now you need to roll back. Let's say you want to go back. So just click on history and from here choose what how much back you want to go. So I just say that we have two only we have two revisions only. So I just select previous one and just click OK. So now you can see that the rollback is being done. So uh, I just came back to my previous spot and you can see it is saying out of sync and now you can refresh the website and it, it's showing the older one. So you can see that we have a yellow line at here, a yellow mark, which is calling as a out of sync because the templates you have mentioned uh, onto the uh, Git repository, which is not matching to the current one. So you just went to back. So this is how you do the rollback uh, using the Argo CD user interface. So I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.